What's going on, Hit Squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all lost jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Thursday. June 17th, and as I say each and every video, make sure you guys uh, smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way, and if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the cycles, just checking out the channel, just checking out me in general, make sure you guys subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys, so you can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. Live streams and stuff too. Make sure you guys join in and talk to me and chat with me during a live stream. If you guys want to see me do any live streams of any other video, even just Red Dead, let me know down in the comments like comment section below so I can try to you know work that into my situation. Um, if you want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that will be in the bottom left-hand corner. It will be down below the video. There's a hashtag down there. And there's a. it's down in the description box below. Um, first things first, let's get to Madame Nazar's location, which today she's back. In McFarland's Ranch, or well, outside of McFarland's Ranch, near Thieves Landing, or Manteca, Man Manteca Falls. Uh, how I personally get to her when she's around this area, well, she's right here. How I get to her when she's in this area is I just simply fast travel to McFarland's Ranch, which it'll put you around in this area somewhere, right around here. And when I land, I just simply take the train track on down to her location, which, so as, as you see, as soon as it turns, I just keep going straight. And she's right there at the end of the little bend right there. She will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know or not of America. Uh... I wouldn't move any camps or anything down here because it's kind of pointless. Once I get to her and I do what I have to do, I simply go into my uh, wilderness camp and try to uh, spawn from out of there. But today you can uh, either go back to McFarland's Ranch and go to Blackwater or ride your horse on up to Blackwater because the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle is right up here inside this first tent right here at this location um as i said this is the caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle it's towards the back of the tent on a crate or a barrel back by the bed like next to the bed um there's also a tarot card over here like on the wagon at the back of a wagon, there is a Queen of Swords tarot card, which is one of Madame Nazar's items, I think, if I'm not sure. And inside this little, I want to call it a tent, but it's like a little small building right here. Right here, inside this building, little small office space, go towards the back on the table, and you will get a ivory comb family heirloom and one more thing is a tarot card right here on this table on this front porch of this house there's a table on the front porch and you will get a eight of pentacles anywho let's get over here to where we normally do business which is all the way across the water which i would not suggest you guys try to cross that water you have to go around but or fast travel to Rhodes or La Grasse, La Grasse, or wherever you want to go. But uh, the cycles for today, Thursday, 
to June 17th are Family Heirloom Cycle 3, All Lost Jury Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Tarot Card Cycle 6, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossils Cycle 3. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The Cycles. A link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Let's get to the things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map. Up first, I'm going to tell you a couple that I do not have marked, which are kind of above a little bit past this little elimination series up here. But first things first, there is a there is a coin right here at this location. This coin is underneath or in between a clothesline. So go in the middle of that clothesline, pull out your metal detector, and that's what you will get. A random coin. Right down here a little bit, right at this location, right about here, you guys will get a random fossil. This random fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is, but come right here at this location with your metal detector. Once again, and that's what you will get, a random fossil. Let's go down a little bit where you guys will need your eagle eye and you need your shovel. You do not need your metal detector for this location right here. Come right here and you guys will get a metal hairpin. Remember, it's a dig spot, so you don't need your metal detector. So come over here with your eagle eye on, and you should see the dig spot glowing or whatever you call it. Uh, one more thing that I don't have marked is right here inside this house. Go inside the house, and you guys will get a tortoiseshell comb. How to get this tortoiseshell comb or the location of... The exact location of this tortoiseshell comb is in the house on the wash table. Look on the other side of the dinner table, and that's the wash table with a mirror and a bowl. Let's go. Uh, there's a couple things up here. Like inside this house, there's a tarot card and a lost jewelry. The lost jewelry is a magnate turquoise ring. It's on top of the fireplace. And on the table next to the house like right about here I think it's right here there's a page of cups tarot card is outside on the table with a bunch of clothes like a pile of clothes is right on that same table anywho let's move over to this location over here Right across the Kamasa River, if you guys want to travel all the way over here, right super close to this square, or yeah, this square right here. This is a moonshine camp. Come over here at this location with your metal detector. Super close to this square, and you guys will hit on a random coin. I cannot tell you guys what coin it is because it is randomized. There's also a Lost jury, a random lost jury. Right here at this location, right behind this shack or building right here, I think there's like a fallen, big fallen tree branch or something like that on the ground. Come over here with the metal detector and you will get a random lost jury. Let's go over to our next location, which is right behind this house, super close to this house, right at the back of it. Pull out your metal detector and you guys will get a random lost jury. This, uh, this location, I cannot tell you any more about that, but it's directly behind the house. Pull out your metal detector and that's what you will get. A random lost jury. Uh, let's go to our next marker, which is a bird egg. This bird egg spawns right here at this location. In a tree is a heron egg, H-E-R-O-N. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Also, 
while you're over in this area, there's a cardinal flower right here if you guys want to grab that as well. Uh, let's go to our next marker, which is inside this house in this first room to your right. Right here at this location, you guys will get a ebony hairpin. This ebony hairpin is sitting on a three-seater bench right here in this room, right at that location. There's also, if you guys want to go up to the second floor, go back to the back of the house, go up the stairs, and go to the balcony. On the balcony, there's a table. On the, that table, you guys will get a tarot card, which is a ten of cups. Uh, outside the house, there's a little bridge right here. This is like a stone bridge. Right here at this location, you guys, underneath this bridge, you guys will get a coin. So go underneath the bridge, pull out your metal detector, and that's what you will get, a random coin. Let's go over here to the cemetery where we have our next marker. Right here at this location, you guys will get a Ru Pearl Necklace. That's R-O-U Pearl Necklace. It's right here inside the Fellows Grave Building, if you guys can see that. Come right here, right in front of it, like right there. And that's how you access the little mausoleum or whatever. But let's go over here to our next marker. Right here at this location, you guys will get another tarot card this tarot card is a seven of swords um it's on the table next to a small broken card right here at that location let's go over or down a little bit to our next marker which is another uh it's about right here which is another lost jury this lost jury here is a, a bellow ruby bangle bracelet it's inside a corner cabinet that maybe someone have thrown out or something like that so it's on the side of the street you have to position yourself in front of this cabinet open up the door then position yourself again you should be prompt to grab the ruby the bellow ruby bangle bracelet out of it let's go to our next marker which is down here right here at this location underneath the ground underground uh you guys will get a antique alcohol bottle this antique alcohol bottle is a tennessee whiskey bottle this tennessee whiskey bottle is on a crate in the middle of the tunnel underneath the ground how you get to that tunnel is you go through the gate that's right here uh hop on this platform that's right here and right about here there's an entrance that looks like it's into the building but it leads you down and around to the antique alcohol bottle uh, once you grab the antique alcohol bottle, reverse and go back and come back and get on your horse and let's go to this next marker, <laughs> which is actually up here. Right here at this location, you guys will get a fossil. This fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you which one, which category you will get, but come right here at this location with your metal detector and that's what you will get, a random fossil. Let's go down to our next marker which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here each and every day. And this is the one that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on. Make sure you pay attention to them lines because that will help a lot. There's also a lost jury right here. If you come over here inside this building at that exact location with your metal detector, you will get a random lost jury um there's not much else uh right beside this stranger mission there's a tree around this tree uh come around this tree with your metal detector and you will get a random coin uh inside the braithwaite manor home there's a family heirloom this family heirloom is about right here inside the house there's a cherry wood comb. This family heirloom is a cherry wood comb. It's upstairs in the room with a chest at the foot of the bed. It's right about that location. So when you do come inside the house, look for the room with the chest at the foot of the bed. Anywho, I got a couple things inside of Rose. One, there's a lost jury right here by this 
house right here. There's a, a outhouse right here at this location. Come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get. There's a couple of tarot cards, like one inside this gazebo here on the table. That is a four of wands. And when that's there, there's a tarot card right here on top of the bank. Um, this is a four of cups. I have a couple more things for you guys, which uh, basically are around this house. One, well, both of them are inside the house. One is a tarot card, which is a nine of cups, is inside the house. And that green shelf that's in the corner right here. And there's also a family heirloom, which is a ebony hairbrush. This ebony hairbrush is in, saw, in that tall wardrobe directly in front of you as soon as you walk into the house right here. Our last marker is a arrowhead. This arrowhead is right beside a tree stump right here at this location. You do not need your metal detector for this one. You just need your shovel. So come over here. At this location, you should see a dig spot. When you dig up that dig spot, you you will get a random arrowhead. I cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized. But that's pretty much it for the things that I have for you guys today. I'm going to put you guys back into frame or focus so you guys can see it. See the things just in case you want to mark them and go for them. But the cycles for today... Thursday, June 17th, once are once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 3, All Lost Jury Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Tarot Card Cycle 6, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossils Cycle 3. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 3, All Lost Jury Cycle 5, Coin Cycle 5, Arrowhead Cycle 1, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, all tarot card cycle six, bird egg cycle four, and fossils cycle three. Uh, remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out. And thank you guys for watching, liking, sharing, commenting, and all that other good stuff. I do appreciate each and every bit of it. Um, it's your baby man, Hitman, once again, and I'm out.